Do you want me to come with you? I'll send somebody up. Okay. Okay. Beautiful sunset happening here. We're all busy. We've got to hurry because it's 7.30. The Kiwis are playing the kangaroos in the league. So the boys are all uh, trying to get this hole sorted. And we're trying to get these... Uh, we've got a barrow full of stones here. Got to go in there. From around the garden. Come at the hoi ho. Rori. Smile for the camera here, fellas. Hi. He's at oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 280, 280 here was just uh, digging that hole with the metal. It's looking good, eh? Looking Very good. good. Well, I think probably another box full of BBs and we'll be there. <laughs> Back up the and the TV. And the TV <laughs> for the rugby. That's where the hole's going. Aye? Hey, Putting a hole over there. We're going down two feet, <laughs> two feet, <laughs> hopefully, maybe a little bit more because of the stones, yeah, two or three. <laughs> <laughs> ah, stop hitting me! The sun's about to set here, but we're digging the hole, well at least these fellas are, eh? Watch out, that head doesn't fall off there, bro. Oh, there you go. So what are we doing now? We've got to wait three hours, and we, somehow we have to get through three hours before we get a feed. <laughs> not an easy uh, thing to do. And bide our time for three hours. It's not an easy thing to do. I tell you what, you thought that getting those stones into the hole was hard? This is hard. No way. At least the stones don't have to come out straight away. Yeah. They can tap it. We're doing our job and we'll make sure we can still talk and walk. <laughs> we'll be practicing our army crawl. Not at that point. He's just checking it out. The lad. He's been good. Well, he has been good. He's checking it out, making sure there's no steam coming through. He is a chief fire with a rafter. That's the one. No steam happening, eh, bro? The smoke is sort of missing. There it is, the mound. There's food in there. I think we did lopsided too. I think it's... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Better tidy it up then, eh? It's a bit lopsided there, bro. This is what do up now. Um, yeah, it cool just cool get those meat catches. Yeah, real cool. Like I was just saying before, like physically, you've got to be fit to do that. Oh yeah, you know, they just run the whole game. Yeah. Saw my cousin. Oh, what did I say? Your career as AFL. Oh. About 30 minutes to go, and then we're gonna we're gonna pull those stones out of there. Stones are white hot now, they are really hot. We've just kept the kept the big blocks of wood on it. We'll move all that wood out and the ashes out and the stones will be going into that hole. Then we're gonna throw some water on that and then put our baskets down and seal the whole lot up. Amen. Amen. Beautiful. The young fellas here are going to be doing all that stuff. Hard work actually bringing those stones out and I'll be videoing that too so you'll see that soon. They're having a few beers here just to uh, keep themselves wetted up.
Very good job, Wayne. Very good job. Thank you, Sissy. Oh, why? <laughs> no. I'm just kidding, Wayne. Just kidding. You're just going hook into some of that meat, all right? Okay, okay. Just get yourself a big plate, bro. <laughs> we catered for about a hundred people, eh? We've got a few missing. Meat underneath. 
Jesus is the Christ, and there is none else. Jesus is the Christ, and there is none else. Kia ora ai koutou 